Hello viewers, today we are going to perform the experiment of pulse amplitude modulation and demodulation. This process is used in digital communication system. Digital communication system is widely used nowadays due to its better quality, noise immunity and simplicity of designing. In this process, we can modulate the amplitude of carrier pulse according to the amplitude of modulating message signal. We shall perform the experiment with the help of a trainer kit as shown in the screen. This trainer kit has 4 inbuilt sections. In the top left corner, the first section is audio frequency signal generator. This section will generate an audio frequency signal to be used as modulating signal or message signal for PAM modulation. The next section is clock pulse generator section, which will generate synchronized clock pulse to be used as carrier pulse for PAM modulation. The third section of this trainer kit is pulse amplitude modulator section, which will provide pulse amplitude modulator signal of three types, that is naturally sampled signal, flat top sampled signal and sample and hold signal. The fourth section, that is the last section of this trainer kit is demodulated section. The fourth section, that is the last section of this trainer kit is demodulator section, which will demodulate the pulse amplitude modulator signal to recover or retrieve the original message signal. Let's start the experiment. We shall connect the ground terminal of oscilloscope to any ground terminal of trainer kit demarcated by green terminal as all the ground terminal are internally connected. Now AF signal generator output is connected to X channel of the oscilloscope while clock pulse generator output is connected to Y channel. Connect the AF signal generator synchronization link to clock pulse generator through patch cord as indicated in the diagram. Now switch on the trainer kit. We can observe a sine wave in X channel which is AF signal and a green square wave in the Y channel which is synchronized clock pulse. We can vary the frequency and amplitude of sine wave with the help of potentiometer provided for this purpose. Similarly, we can adjust the frequency of clock pulse with the potentiometer provided in this section. Now we shall connect the input sine wave and clock pulse signal to the modulator section by patch cords. Here Y channel will be connected to PAM modulated output and X channel to AF signal generator output. Here we can see PAM signal in the oscilloscope screen when the selector switch is pressed towards natural sampling mode. We can adjust the frequency of PAM wave with the help of potentiometer provided in this trainer kit. Now we shall place the selector switch towards sample and hold mode. In this condition, we can observe the sample and hold signal in our oscilloscope screen. Now, the oscilloscope Y channel will be connected to the flat top sample signal output terminal. Here, we can observe the flat top sample signal in oscilloscope screen, when the selector switch is still placed towards sample and hold mode. Now, we shall connect the demodulator section output to the oscilloscope Y channel. Connect the flat top sampled output to the demodulator section input. Turn on the oscilloscope. After slight adjustment, we can observe the demodulated wave in oscilloscope screen. We can adjust the amplitude of demodulated wave with the help of potentiometer provided in this section. Now let's switch on the natural sampling output terminal. Push the selector switch towards natural sampling mode. After slight adjustment, we are able to get back the original AF signal. If we vary the amplitude of AF signal, the amplitude of demodulated wave is changing accordingly. Similarly, if we vary the frequency of original AF signal, the demodulated signal also responds properly. Hence, we can conclude that we have properly demodulated the PAM signal and recovered the original message signal. The complete operation manual of this experiment can be downloaded from the link given in the description box. If you really like this video, please hit the like button, share with your friends and subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to get notification first. 
For any product related information, please visit our website www.kalpanascientific.com. That's all for now. Hope to meet you soon with another informative video like this. Till then, bye bye.